Welcome back to Tain Slayer Info. We all know that India has ordered 56 Airbus C295 medium tactical transport aircraft for the Indian Air Force with an additional 6 units for the Indian Coast Guard. As we have seen enough information about the Indian Air Force C295 aircrafts, this video will provide vital details about the 6 units of C295 which has been ordered for the Indian Coast Guard. Even though Indian Coast Guard operates other aircrafts and helicopters, the main aim for them to procure these Airbus aircrafts is to monitor the India's exclusive economic zone. For those who are not aware what actually is an exclusive economic zone, according to the 1982 United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea, an exclusive economic zone is an area of the sea in which a country has special rights regarding the exploration and uses of the marine resources, including energy production from water and wind. In addition to monitoring the India's exclusive economic zone, Indian Coast Guard will also be using these C-295 for search and rescue missions, detecting and tracking sea and air targets. So in order to perform these operations, these Airbus C-295 cannot be used in the same configuration of Indian Air Force. To make these C-295 compatible for their fleet, the Indian Coast Guard will work along with the Center for Airborne Systems to modify the aircraft into a multi-mission maritime aircraft variant for airborne surveillance with C-4ISR. The C-4ISR stands for the Command, Control, Communications, Computers, Intelligence, Surveillance and Reconnaissance. These multi-mission maritime aircraft will use sensors which is developed for the airborne early warning and control for the Indian Air Force. So that was a video to provide an update on Indian Coast Guard's plan to modify their six Airbus C-295 aircrafts which would be manufactured in India by Tata along with Airbus into a multi-mission maritime aircraft. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tainslade Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.